Are you ready to plunge into the latest episode of Blueface's continuing legal saga? This narrative continues to enthrall and stun as fresh revelations emerge, portraying a grim picture of the rapper's future. Recently, Chris and Rock, tears pouring down her cheeks, made a surprising confession during a court hearing. She intimated that Blueface could be facing a longer stint behind bars, news that has sent waves through their community and audience. Hi there, and welcome back to Rumor Spill. This trial has revealed dark secrets and brought fresh witnesses whose testimony seems to have sealed Blueface's doom. It's a stark testament to a system that looks to have failed them, leading to a terrible loss of faith in justice. As we go deeper into the specifics of Blueface's extended incarceration, you'll find the unfolding story not just shocking, but also humanizing. Switching gears, we also discuss Chrissy and Rock's own progress despite these challenging circumstances. The emotional toll is obvious when she describes a touching interaction with Blueface during one of the court sessions. It was a time filled with grief, yet accented by surprising warmth. In a rare display of kindness, the judge permitted Blueface a little chance to touch their baby boy, Junior. This melancholy reunion transpired against the stark background of the courtroom, exposing the deep complexities of their relationship. Crisson's description clearly describes the scene. Blueface was cradling their son, his emotions scarcely restrained. She remained there, hesitant whether to kiss him, a reflection of the deep ambiguities and constraints imposed by their situation. This moment, however momentary, showed the raw, personal characteristics typically obscured by the headlines. Despite the tremendous hurdles, Chrissine remains a pillar of support for Blueface, sailing the stormy waters of their voyage together with dedication and steadfast support. She remarked how Blueface's look has changed the beginnings of a beard, his hair developing dreadlocks a visual evidence of the time past. His reaction to seeing her and their child was a mix of amazement and excitement, a rare slice of normalcy in an otherwise tumultuous scenario. Yet amidst these emotional moments, there are murmurs of larger troubles. Christine alluded to issues during the trial that could lengthen Blueface's term in prison greatly. Although the facts remain hazy, the consequences are clear and worrisome. The nature of these revelations and their potential implications for his future are a topic of significant discussion and anxiety. Just a week earlier, insider sources revealed that Blueface was not faring well in jail, with suspicions flying regarding an extension of his term beyond early predictions. Throughout this process, Blueface himself has stayed fairly mute, providing no statements regarding his predicament. In contrast, his mother, Carissa Saffold, has been vociferous on social media, pointing accusations at his ex-partners for their roles in his present legal difficulties. Carissa's posts indicate a chaotic behind-the-scenes dynamic between Blueface's exes, Jaden Alexis and Chrissy and Rock, which she says has severely impacted his legal difficulties. This chronicle of conflict and familial strife provides a look into the inner battles that complicate his public legal issues. Carissa's calls to familial unity and the agony of seeing her son incarcerated emphasize the personal toll this drama has placed on those closest to Blueface. But how did he find himself in this labyrinth of legal difficulties? Let's backtrack and evaluate his high-profile contacts with the law that have shaped his current dilemma. The difficulties began with a stunning occurrence at Skinny's Lounge in the San Fernando Valley on September 12, 2021. What started as a quarrel over identity swiftly escalated into violence. The surveillance film shows Blueface and his crew engaging in a nasty brawl with a bouncer, leaving him with major injuries. This event was merely the beginning of a series of legal fights for the artist. A few weeks later, Another incident at the Euphoric Gentleman's Club in Las Vegas compounded his legal difficulties. A fight prompted by an apparently simple jest led to shooting. Blueface allegedly shot at a man outside the club, further entangling him in legal issues. The victim's brief escape from serious injury 
added to the gravity of Blueface's allegations, which included attempted murder and firearm crimes. As the court cases piled up, the financial ramifications were astounding. A verdict surpassing $13 million against Blueface for damages and lost revenue at the Euphoric Gentlemen's Club constituted a huge blow to his finances. Through all these trials, Blueface has faced the law's full power, grappling with the implications of his acts. As we continue to follow his journey, it is a sad reminder of the quick ascent and probable fall of a music career entwined with legal struggle. The future chapters of this drama will surely be essential in defining the trajectory of Blueface's life and career. The significant financial penalty underlined the wide ramifications of Blue's actions and experience he was bound to bear long after the media frenzy had faded. It's been stated that only true players can confront incarceration with the nonchalance of someone headed on an adventure in the Himalayas. Good luck, man, they'd say, amidst the commotion. Yet, in the midst of this volatility, a constant question dogged both his fans and critics. What had propelled Blue down such a perilous route? Was it the relentless strain of celebrity, the seductive call of the streets, or a deadly blend of both? As people probed into the complicated variety of causes that contributed to his deterioration, each explanation offered a view into the mind of a troubled artist stuck in the success trap. From Bern, Maryland, I, Yamam, often find myself irritated by stories like this. It's a typical scenario of a celebrity losing themselves to their overblown ego. Amidst the constant legal predicaments, Chris and Rock has stuck by Blue resolutely, managing their relationship's ups and downs with strong loyalty. Her continued support during Blue's incarceration has shed a beacon of hope through the gloom. In a candid Instagram Live session, Chris and opened up about their strong connection characterizing it as akin to best friend sentiments that only they could completely know. Despite enduring various hurdles, her commitment to Blue has been unbreakable, defying the physical separations and hardships. T first, Christian felt she might coolly move on after he was arrested. However, contrary to her initial thoughts, she found herself drifting back towards Blue. Their nightly phone calls became a key connection in the pandemonium of his jail stay. How can you talk for like 24 hours straight? She wondered about their lengthy discussions. As Chrissy navigated through their delicate relationship, reports about her desire to move back in with Blue stirred questions within their circle. Despite pushback from Blue's mother, Carissa Saffold, Chrissy remained determined to help him through these tough times. Oh... She's going in there for him, huh? Someone speculated. Kristen's social media posts hinted at a relationship that surpassed ordinary bonds. Meanwhile, tensions with Blue's mother grew to unprecedented heights. Carissa, renowned for her talkative attitude, hinted at a possible court battle with Christian through her posts. I wish she would find someone else's child to meddle with, Carissa stated, exposing the deep-seated anger that had been simmering, exacerbated by ongoing conflicts and the custody battle over Chrysan Jr. The familial conflict was evident, with emotions running high on all sides. As the prospect of a legal clash increased, the atmosphere was fraught with suspense and dread. Amid this upheaval, Kristen remained a tower of strength for Blue, exhibiting great bravery and perseverance despite her own need for support. However, as the dispute between Chrissy and Carissa escalated, it seemed a storm was brewing. Will peace eventually prevail, or are there darker days ahead for Chrissy and Blue? As we peel back the layers of drama surrounding Blue's court fights and the delicate dynamics of his relationships, we encourage you to offer your views. What do you think about Chrissy's steadfast support for Blue in light of the difficulty she faces? Do you foresee the difficulties with Blue's mother growing, or is there hope for reconciliation? Your opinions are vital to this conversation. Subscribe Rumor Spill for more videos.